Hi guys, Black is here. I'm catching hell trying to get this pipe to fit onto my old hot pipe. Uh, what do you call it? The return pipe, low pressure pipe or whatever. It's the same size as this pipe. Of course, it won't go on. It's like two F-150s hidden head on. One of them is not going to fit in the back of the other one. Anyway, um, my plan is this. Uh, I tried to find a tool to expand this. I can't find it. Well, I found one that's just online. So I tried to find a fitting that would, this would slide into and would allow me to slide onto another one. In other words, a fitting that would slide over these. Can't find one. If I, well, let me change that. I found one, but it's too damn big. This is what I'm talking about. This is the fit I'm talking about. It won't fit. So this is no good. Now I can use this fitting. It'll slide in. But again, it won't go on my old fitting. This is too big. They claim it won't seal. And it won't seal. So I'm thinking that maybe if I can heat this up and I don't know, get a, a bolt or something and try to get it to go in here, I can maybe expand this. So that's what I'm doing now. But first I gotta find something that'll go in here. I've looked in my toolbox and the only thing I can find is this 10 millimeter. So I'm gonna heat this up. And all I needed to do is, is to stretch it out about maybe that far and then it'll slide in the other two. So I'm going to heat this up and then I'm going to get on a hammer and hit down on this. Um, now the camera is going to probably fall. I might be able to do it here. Um, Thing is gonna probably get hot. Hey, can that work? All right, can that work? Guess we'll find out. Okay, here we go. I borrowed a hand truck from my neighbor to help me move this um to help me move this condenser. Oh, damn dogs ain't out here. All right. Um, Man, when, oh yeah, that's right, I took that thing. I was getting ready to say. Looking at it, doesn't seem to matter. The white wire is going to here. It's going to one side. And the red wire is going to hell, I can't really tell. All right. Just in case it matters, I decided to unhook one wire, which was the white wire. And it looks like the white wire is hooking to this side. 
I don't think it matters what side, but it does. And so the red wire is hooking to this side. So uh, I just wanted to make that clear. And I need to unhook the wires from this and that. And take this thing off. I think they call it a, um, a whip. And that'll be it. Damn, I need a screwdriver. By the way, the power's been disconnected from the house. So I don't think it's getting in the power. Uh, let me go get a flathead screwdriver. Take this whip loose. You just need to pair of pliers to turn this right here. And oh hell, the whole thing is turning. get a flat <clears throat> today is the first time I put off on this year I come around here the damn musket landed on my arm here step down off this rock it's gonna fall
I've always wondered what these things look like on the bottom. So this is what it looks like on the bottom. Well, I'll be down. All right, I forgot to film me putting it back on the damn slab, but it wasn't that hard. Do look a lot nice, except it's kind of crooked. So I guess I need to straighten it up, right? Yep, I do need to straighten it up some. And I just found out the other evaporator was a three and a half ton. But the inside, I don't know what the hell the inside is. I don't know if it's the inside three and a half ton or a two ton. All I know is the two ton evaporator barely fits. But anyway, um, I guess I need to slide this around and hook it up. Before I put Freon in it, I came up with this idea. Ah, oh, shut up. I came across the idea to pump air into the AC unit. Pump air into the AC unit. I went up there and I checked, there's no air. There's no air leaking. So, now I'm ready to hook my lines up and pump Freon into it. As far as vacuuming out the system, I don't vacuum out my car and it works just fine. Some people will say, well, Black, the car is not like the, um, I don't think it's leaking. How much pressure did I put on it? Enough that it should have been leaking. And this is what I capped it with. This came with the, um, we call it condenser. So um, I guess that's it. Now I just gotta find some lines to hook, hook up to that and run it over to this. Dre, y'all have a good one.